guys welcome or welcome back to my channel today we are starting the seven days of halloween nail art series where i upload a video every day for the last week of october showing you some super cute fun halloween nail designs i'm just starting off today's design by painting all of the nails a solid color and then i am going in with a matte top coat because I plan on doing some chrome stamping and some watercolor at a later time. Right here, I'm just showing you the stamping plates that I am using. The Hocus Pocus ones are from Mundo de Unas, and this last plate here is from Clear Jelly Stamper. I'm just going in with a silver chrome to prep my old stamper for the chrome stamping. And we are going to be using CJS Clear Sticky Polish. I just wanted to take these little like dainty witch designs and put as the background of some of the main witches. I absolutely love chrome stamping. I think it just looks so beautiful. I'm just taking this straight up black color from Maniology. And we are going to stamp this cauldron here. It was a nice big open image, which I thought would be perfect for watercolor. <laughs> Next up, I'm just looking for some more like opened images to use for watercolor. That is what I knew I was going to do on these two nude nails. I went into this design with zero ideas, but I really like how it turned out. Now we are starting the thumb. I'm just going to put Winnie down on the bottom. She is my favorite of the three sisters. Then we are going to take this layered spell book that is open here in the corner. If I had my time back, I totally would have redid the thumb. I mean, I like how it turned out, but I have so many more ideas watching this back that I could have done instead. I also decided to add some little chrome stamping designs to this nail as well. I love to have my nails loaded in nail art. Now we are going to go in and add these silhouettes of the other witch sisters and add on top of the chrome stamping we did earlier. I just find this gives more like depth to the nail. I just love layering nail art. If you are nervous to mess up your chrome stamping, you could put a top coat over first and then add the next layer. Next I'm using these Art & Fly watercolor pens. These are from Amazon. A lot of you guys have been asking for the link to these, but I have not been able to find them. I did find the link to something similar though, so I will leave it down below for you to check out. We're just going to go in with the orange to make some flames. Then I'm going to go in with this super dark gray. It's like a gray black color to fill in the cauldron. And I'm going to do the steam coming out of the pot in a green color. After that, we just need to fill in the potion bottle and the spell book here, and then we are going to move on the top coat. This is Magic Hyper Shine Tackless Top Coat, my favorite top coat on this planet. We are just going to top coat all of our nails and then our design is complete. 
thank you all so much for watching today's video. I really hope that you enjoy it. Come back tomorrow for day number two, which is graveyard theme. And I also have a lot of other cool designs planned for the rest of the week. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of them. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next video.